What is going on guys, DBG here, in this video we are going to be using probably the best value card right now in NBA 2K18 my team. And it's the Amethyst Hakeem Olajuwon. So right now you can get Hakeem Olajuwon for less than 15k MT. 15k for this card. Like, let's have a look at his stats. He's better than this Hassan Whiteside. Straight up, he's better. He's got three Hall of Fame badges. Rim Protector, which is one of the best ones to have for a center. Pump and Under Specialist, which is incredible. Of course, he was going to have this Hall of Fame. The badge used to literally be called Dream Like Up and Under. It used to be named after him. And Drop Stepper, which is one of the best post badges to have. He's so also got Gold, Brick Wall and Bruiser, which are good. Gold, Difficult Shots, which helps. Pick and Popper is good. Catch and Shoot is alright. Lob City Finisher. Does he have Pick and Roller? Yep. Relentless Finisher, Post Spin Technician, Gold is another good one to have. Gold Defensive Stopper, Gold also Rebounder. He also has Clutch Performer and defensive anchor which are two really good personality badges to have. Hakeem Olajuwon's stats are incredible as well. He's seven foot tall so he's not small at all for a center. Not incredibly tall but not small. He's got a 98 standing layup. He's at 95 post fadeaway, 97 post hook. That's the one major reason I have him over Hassan Whiteside is because of the post hook and the mid-range shot. He's an 88 mid-range shot with a money, absolutely money release. Almost shot three of 63. I know there's a shoe on the one here. But it is normally a 63. Um, he's going to hit them from the corner. That's about it. But he's got a nice release. And it's better to be able to hit them from the corner and not be able to hit them at all, I guess. He's got ball control 61. Not the best. Good free throw rating of 80. Great rebounding stats. Great box out. Ladder wings of 80, which is unbelievable for 7 foot players. So if he switches onto a guard, he'll be well able to stay in front of them. 88 blocks, really good. Steal of 65. Could be a little bit higher, but not too bad at all. Shot contest 97. Great on ball defensive IQ, great low post defensive IQ. He's got 70 speed, which is good for a 7 footer, and also has a standing dunk tendency of 95, driving dunk of 95. He's got a standing dunk of 95, and even though his driving dunk is only 58, because of the tendency, he does tend to dunk a lot. And he's 15 KMT. So Hakeem Olajuwon is the cheapest amethyst center in the game. Boogie's a really good center as well. That's an amethyst. But I definitely have Hakeem slightly ahead of him. This is the team we're running. We're going with James Harden, Quinton Richardson, Gerald Wallace, Carmelo, and Hakeem. Off the bench, we're going to go with Ben Simmons, Jimmy Butler, Carmelo Anthony, Kristaps Porzingis, and his hand white side. We've got Larry Sanders, Zilgowskis, and Bradley Beal's last three off the bench. So anyway, now let's get on to the game. All right, so we're up against an all right squad. But a squad that we might have seen on day one of the game. So he's got Bruce Bowen. And he's got a lot of collection rewards. <coughs> so, it'll be alright. Won't be the best team, it'll be okay. And Hakeem lets Jeremy Lin score a layup on him. Not good defense right there. Trying to Hakeem. And Hakeem gets two right back. So I'll take it. Let's go Harden. I've never actually used this Jeremy Lin, which is kind of, which is crazy like. A card that was there since day one. Good board, Hakeem. A card that's been there since day one that I haven't actually used. Take him up, step through, and one on, nearly. But Hakeem's got a good free throw, so he should nail the two of these. And he's got a nice release as well. Hits the first. And hits the second, let's go. Oh, Hakeem's gone by him, he's gone by him. And Hakeem missed the layup, but he still gets the board. Gets swatted, and he doesn't get it. Oh, he should not have taken that second shot. That was a nice move though. And it's a really tough shot and it's swatted again. I'm shooting dumb, dumb shots with Hakeem. I'm just shooting dumb shots with him. Let's get him in the pick and roll. Get him in the pick and roll, some easy dunks. They're the type of shots we need with him. Oh, nice spin. Nice spin, Hakeem. And <laughs> Hakeem scores. All right, Hakeem's got all eight of our points so far and we're up by four. Okay, he's not. He's not actually, he hasn't... Uh, jumped at any one of them. So the step through is not going to work. So I might as well just keep shooting post hooks and fades. And he's hit three shots in a row. So Hakeem's starting to get a little bit back into the game anyway. And he just gets jammed on. I oh, finished Ben Simmons. I'm one. Why'd he go from so deep? Five point lead at the end of the first. We only scored 13 points, which is terrible. But only conceding eight is really good. So... I'm confident enough we're going to win this game very comfortably, but um, yeah, let's hope we, get, we can get a little bit of a better lead anyway to start the second quarter. Jam that. Let's go, Whiteside. Midi. And Whiteside nails it. My defense, Porzingis. We're just too big. Smallest player on the floor is 6'5", and that's my two guard. From deep, Bradley Beal. And he misses over the board. Our defense has been 
quite poor to start the second quarter, but our offense has been good, so... At least one of them's good. I'm jumping. Easy dunk. Let's go, keep. We got him that way. We easily enough got him that way. And Joe Walls the board. Q Rich. Go keep. I'm jumping. Or not. Still got the layup. Good drop, Step Akeem. Use the screen. Oh, we can't pass up this shot. Doesn't matter that we're going through a key. And he misses the wide open three. Come on, Arden. Nice spin. That's easy dunk for a game. Corner mid. And BL nails that. Alright, 12 point lead. We've got a bit of a lead now. We're starting to pile up the points on them. They're shooting a really low percentage. And we leave Kyrie wide open. Okay, midi from Simmons. Wasn't a good shot. I just should have jump shot with Ben Simmons. That's why I don't like playing with Simmons too much. And we're up nine at halftime. Better quarter offensively or worse quarter defensively. So hopefully um, we can pick it up in the third and blitz him. Great defense. Is that a shot clock? Nope. Pretty much though. Mellow. Oh, easy. Midi. Oh, come on, I'll get scouty better than that. That's an easy dunk for Mello, though. And one Carmelo Anthony. We'll step through. Oh, come on, Hakeem. How was that smothered? Like, there was no... Just because someone's in the general area of a person taking a shot, they make no attempt to contest, especially in the post. It should not be smothered. No wonder the post game is very rarely used in 2K. I'm jumping. Easy layup. And one. Let's go, Hakeem. Good board, Hakeem. Q Rich. Okay, I don't think I've taken a shot with Quentin Richardson yet, so I need to put one up. 95 shot three. I need to at least one three with my game. I'm jumping. Easy lap. Hakeem with 23. And shooting over 50% from the field. Which was not the best. It's way, way better than my team's average anyway. And swatted. Put into him again. Easy dunk. Let's go. I'm sp spinning. Take him up. And fell. Came on the line. Is the first. And he is the second. 27 for Akeem. Reball. And Cam Malone misses, but Akeem's there with the board. And Akeem misses, but he gets another rebound. And he puts it in. It's a bad shot. And Akeem just have to get in the double double with a quarter to go. The three. And Harden puts it in. Oh, it's open. 90 shot three. Good wide open. And Melo misses it. Melo again. Good open. And he misses again. Oh, 2K. 2K. Come on. Very finished by his Jeremy Lin right there over Big Z. There's Larry Sanders who's playing small forward and he has to dunk. We've got three centers on the floor right now. A 6'11", 6'10", uh, point guard and Jimmy Butler. Spun him the other way. And the game, why didn't you just finish your left hand right there? And one. I'll take it. The game with 33 points, is it? 31. Make that 32. Okay, they're not contesting that at all. He didn't even jump at that. How was that heavily contested? Oh, fadeaways are so much more uh, underpowered this year than they have been in previous years. And one, Hakeem. Let's go. And he rage quits. Hakeem with like 34 points with about a minute or so to go. So anyway, that's the video. In my opinion, this Hakeem Olajuwon card is the single best value card you can get in NBA 2K18, my team. If this card could shoot threes, it would literally be the best center by far in the game. Like, it's better than the Kareem Abdul-Jabbar Amphis card. It's better than the Hassan Whiteside Diamond card, who goes for almost double the price. 
It's better than every center I've used this year, including the Amethyst Marcus Cousins. Even though the Amethyst Buggy is a beast of a card, to be fair. That card is really nice. But this is a game, in my opinion, the best value. Like 15k. 15k for 93 overall Amethyst. And it's not like Malone, who suffers from being a little bit undersized for his position. Hakeem has got everything. He's seven foot tall. He's got really good Hall of Fame badges. And he's just an absolutely incredible card to use this year in NBA 2K in my team. And if you haven't used him yet, I would strongly, strongly suggest you pick him up. So anyway, that's the video. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.